Hi everybody, I'm Wendy Saltz with the Power Media Agency and your tip of the day. And for your tip today, we are wrapping up our three-part series on how to be a more persuasive speaker, talking about trial closes. Now, most people know about a close or an ask, where you're asking for somebody to do something or you're asking for their business. But a lesser known technique that can help you be a more persuasive speaker is what is called a trial close. Now, the point of a trial close is to gather more information from your listener and also to see where you're at in the selling process. It's something you do along the way as you are speaking, asking questions to get feedback. So for instance, a trial close could be asking something such as, do you believe that the solution I am talking about will meet your needs? You could say something like, am I missing anything here? Or are you confident that this will work for you? There are a multitude of different trial closes, but the point here is to ask open-ended questions that will help you to figure out if you are getting buy-in from your listener. Are they buying into what you're saying? And the more often you are getting yeses and positive responses to those trial questions, the more likely it will be that you will get a yes at the end. So for your tip of the day today, to be a more persuasive speaker, make sure that you are using trial closes, that you are asking for information and soliciting responses from your listener to help provide you with more information about where you are at in the selling process and will help you also identify any sticking points in your argument so that you can overcome those objections. And thank you for turning to me, Wendy Saltzman and the Power Media Agency for all of your public speaking, media training, and executive coaching needs.